I was asked you was um, you were a visiting coach in the league before you were here. I was wondering when you saw Al play as a freshman, what were some things that you noticed just from you know seeing him one or two games a year with Cornell that impressed you? I saw him play as a junior hockey player as well. Oh, yeah. I saw him up there. You know, everyone was kind of just, uh, you know, obviously he was really light. And, uh, you know, you're wondering if he needed another year from a physical standpoint. And, uh, you know, just obviously good player. You know, he had, uh, he had good hockey sense. I think the probably thing I didn't, the uh, reason why I mentioned I saw him play is um, you probably don't appreciate some of his really outstanding qualities is, uh, you know, he, he's really competitive and comes to practice hard and loves the game of hockey and, uh, you know, practices straight. It's, uh, so from that perspective, you know, you, you saw him as a smaller, uh, explosive skater and a skill guy, and that's not always the characteristics you have of those type of players. Um, and he brings a lot of intangible qualities to the table and the passion for the game that, as a coach, you really appreciate. He's been pretty consistent his whole career. He's had, you know, anywhere from 23 to 25 points every year and this year he's already in that range so probably go higher uh, you know how impressive is that too to find a guy that can, you can kind of count on for same numbers every year or better you know yeah, I just think it's, I think consistency obviously is a hallmark, you know, one of the best traits you can have, right? And, uh, you know, obviously Al's been that. Um, you know, I, like I told you, it, his consistency in, in how he prepares and how he works and how he goes about the game, uh, you know, on, on the most part, it's been, uh, been outstanding. And, you know, I can't ask for anything more. Um, you know, it's uh, uh, one of those situations where maybe, uh, you know, we're not by a scoring team, so that maybe has limited him a little bit in terms of it, but over time, but, you know, he, he is a big cog for us, or, you know, with us in terms of our success, and, and I know he feels that, and uh, feels a big part of it, and, you know, he, he prepares properly. I know, it's like when, when I talk to him after games where it's a win or a loss, you can tell he's kind of got a passion for what he's doing out there. I mean, if it's a loss, he's, he looks like he's taking it really hard. Or, I mean, what, is that something that you like to see, too, in a player? A good teammate. You know, he's a good player and he's a good teammate, and he holds guys accountable within the locker room. He holds himself accountable to a high standard, yeah. uh, self-evaluates real well. That's a, that's an important quality to have of uh, of a good player, and he has all those qualities. So, uh, you know, when you watch him, he wears his emotions on his sleeve. Uh, so he's, he's just that type of guy that uh, obviously, obviously, I mean, he has some he has some outstanding qualities, right? I mean, his skating right. skills, uh, you know, for his explosiveness between the blue lines, he backs guys off as good as anybody in the league. Yeah. Uh, you know, that's probably one of his greatest qualities. Uh, but he also uses that on the penalty kill and in a lot of key situations for us. So, yeah. um, you know, we felt that uh, when I first got here, we had him on a wing, uh, but we felt that they, sometimes he was too far ahead of the play yeah. by playing on a wing, leaving his own early. And once we got him back at center and settled in, uh, you know, I thought that was a big turning point for him. Yeah. It's the last thing he's asked about. So See after you know a month or so, his you know college days will be done. If you like looking at pro chances, what kind of potential do you think he has to you know in the pro hockey world? I would think with his skills, if he gets in a group. Of oh, he'll have a, he'll have a legitimate chance of moving on. He'll have yeah. to prove himself at the levels and move. But uh, his hockey sense and his skating skills uh, mm -hmm. are going to enable him to do to uh, you know his role may change at that at that point in time, right? But uh, for an energy player and a chance uh, to get up there and uh, chip in and, and be a key cog, I think I think he's got a lot of upside for yeah. for where he's going to be able to play. Thanks.